this is the Daily Two. All children under the age of eight in Georgia are required to be properly restrained in an appropriate child passenger safety seat or booster seat. Welcome to the Daily Two. With me today is Jackie Polisi, family safety advocate from Motlick and Associates. Hi, Shannon. Most parents know to use child safety seats for very young children, but once their child outgrows the safety seat, it's time to move into a booster seat. Not only is it the law, but without a booster seat, children can become seriously injured or killed. And according to the Georgia Office of Highway Safety, children using booster seats are 59 percent less likely to be injured in a crash than those using a seatbelt alone. Jackie, how do parents know when it's time to switch to a booster seat? Children should stay in a forward-facing car seat for as long as possible or until they reach the weight or height limit recommended by the car seat manufacturer. That can be anywhere from age four to eight years old, which is longer than most parents think. Children must use a booster seat until the seat belt fits them properly when they have reached four feet nine, usually between ages eight and 12. In a booster seat, what's the correct position for the seatbelt? The shoulder belt should cross the middle of the child's chest and shoulder. Make sure the lap belt lies low across the child's upper thighs, never across the stomach. That's important because if the lap belt rides up on the child's abdomen, it can cause serious internal injuries in a crash. Also, never place the shoulder belt across the child's neck, behind the back or under the arm. And parents, please remember the safest place for children under 13 is always in the back seat. Very helpful advice. For a copy of the firm's free booster seat safety guide, go to motlick.com and click on child passenger safety. I'm Shannon Walsh with The Daily Two. For more Daily Two, go to wsbtv.com slash daily two.